Okay, we are on experiment number five. The ammonia ammonium hydroxide equilibrium. So here I have a bottle of concentrated ammonium hydroxide just to show you that it does not have much of a color. It looks like we are in ice water. Okay, so to begin the experiment, we are asked to take a beaker every 15 milliliters of DI water, which I have here, and you're supposed to add two drops of concentrated ammonium hydroxide which I already did under the safety hood since we cannot use a concentrated ammonium hydroxide outside a safety hood. So I've already done that here. I did it under the safety hood and brought it out. So that's a solution of ammonium hydroxide plus the deionized water here. And then we are supposed to add to that two drops of phenolphthalein. Now before we do that, make sure you record the color of that solution. and. Watch and see what happens when you add two drops of phenolphthalein. Wow, that is a really nice bright color. So I would let you call that color. Okay, this indicates the color of phenolphthalein in basic solution. If you remember your acid-base titration from Chem 140, this is the color of the endpoint, not this dark, but somewhere close to this shape. Okay, so that's the color of ammonium hydroxide with phenolphthalein. Now, we are supposed to split that into two containers. I grabbed another small beaker. I'm going to pour half of that into another beaker. And one will be our reference or the control experiment, which I will take that as my control. And I'm going to work with the solution here. To that, we are supposed to add a solution of 2 mole ammonium acetate. And we have 2 mole ammonium acetate right here. So I'll move this so you can see the bottle. Oh. And we are going to add ammonium acetate until you see a color change. So let's start doing that and keep an eye on the colors. Okay. Alrighty. Until the color is all gone. And this was the initial color. Now the color is all gone. So you want to record the new color when you add ammonium acetate. So that is a ammonia ammonium hydroxide equilibrium.